ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, now we have a true model uh, next to me. But Cindy also not only model but also cosmetologist. Mm -hmm. Come from all the way from Connecticut. How long it took you, right, uh, to come here? About an hour and thirty minutes. Wow. Uh, hopefully by now you're a little relaxed and uh, get a chance to do a little bit of makeup. I don't know, we kind of cut it short because I book it inappropriately the wrong suite. But uh, I think uh, whether you have makeup or not, people can see that you're pretty. Yep. <laughs> uh, Thank you. Tell us uh, a little bit, uh, since you have dual career, you cosmetologist and a model, how, to, how people make money as cosmetologist? Well, for me and my business, I work at a place which is, um, you know, commission based off. And then when I'm off, whenever I'm off, I um, I take clientele and then I rebook, get mm -hmm. them coming back. All I the see. Time. Uh, me and a couple of friends now, if you saw, we're starting new two salons, one in Brooklyn, one in uh, Manhattan. And it's going to be kind of style of the Uber. Uh, we uh, it's a 24 7 uh, hair makeup in the cosmetology basically we have a, a regular shift uh, from uh, 10 to 7 and but we also have a shift from uh, 7 p 7 p.m. till 3 a.m. and one shift from 3 a.m. till uh, 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 10, 10 a.m. so if people need to do their hair, hair makeup really really early uh, before they, or they go to important meeting or they need to do you know, like at night before they go clubbing they, they can still come at 12 o'clock 1 o'clock at night and they still can get professional service uh, also, that one has similar kind of environment uh, to the studio because it's a very large space. So we have the backgrounds, we have the uh, lights, we have the photographer and stuff. So uh, the idea is that uh, right after you do your hair, you know, your makeup, that's when you look the best. And once you step on the street, the, the hair gets messy, the you know the makeup uh, gets uh, older. So the best look you get right in the salon. So that's where uh, the studio is uh, available. And a lot of studios, like you see, uh, space here, the, the break, uh, open 9 to 5, regular hours. And uh, since we are open 24-7 uh, uh, at night, a lot of uh, people who have day jobs, they cannot come to regular uh, hours, but they can come at night. Okay. So that's the a little bit of uh, product placement on my side in your interview. Uh, my question to you next one is about uh, how to be happy as a model cosmetologist. A lot of models uh, very depressed, as you know, mm -hmm. and they need this constant admiration, those likes um, on stage to, to validate their uh, being pretty and uh, interesting. How to stay happy? Um, I think. I think it's just very important, very crucial that you just every morning wake up and look at yourself in the mirror, remind yourself who you are, and how beautiful you are, and remind yourself confidence is key. That's really okay. how. Why do you need to remind you? you why, can you be just happy? Mm, um, you, you need to bring that up because I think if I get a lot of sleep, if I have good food, if I my fam my kids, my too. wife, <laughs> I, I see beautiful uh, paintings, uh, cool stuff. I don't need to, you know, once I'm rested and I'm happy, uh, I, I feel happy. Just do <laughs> what you want to do. To say. Just, okay. just do what you want to do to make, that makes you happy, you know? Okay, cool. Um, how do you create opportunities into realities? Um, for that question, I have to say manifestation plays a big part. I just keep playing the same vision I want in my head and it miraculously just happens. Happens. That's, okay. That's, <laughs> that's cool. Uh, as a cosmetologist, how do you keep uh, your skin healthy? Drinking a lot of water. Water is that key. Water is the key. Know, water, water, water. But we have amazing water here in New York. Uh, I think Connect doesn't have that kind of water. Like, is there like a, uh, uh, like, do you drink any particular water? Um, it has to be like a high alkaline water. Mm-hmm. That's the best kind of water. I okay, a lot, a lot of water. Mm -hmm. um, and it's a little heavy it's on the bladder. 9.0, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah so, always. you need to have bathroom uh, yep, all at all time, time available. <laughs> okay. Um, next question is how to ignore or not ignore uh, nayers. If someone doesn't like uh, your style, what, what, you, what do you do? I think um, take into consideration whatever critique they have and... Um, respectfully just take it in and do what you want with it I'd, okay i'd say to take it into consideration and you know uh, but uh, 
is there any particular uh, uh, technique that you have? Let's say you're very pretty, right? Mm -hmm. When you walk the streets of Manhattan, you see, let's say I'm a photographer. I want to recruit another model. What would be a proper uh, uh, opening line uh, for me to, to say to you? Uh, do I, I give you my business card saying I, I, fil I film or do, uh, maybe it's uh, just made up. I just want to, you know, the guy wants to sleep with you. Or uh, if, yeah. how do you know, like if I show you my Instagram, I have lots of followers. Is that on my Instagram? Or like how, how do I get attention to a model um. of, of the street? off the street i think that you need to be very careful because i have definitely been in situations where that's happened and um mm -hmm. it's not fun so i think you just have to be very strong-minded like for that and what, do you, what do you mean like uh, i'm married guys so i'm i'm not looking for the like let's say in my and many of my friends are who film and uh, uh work you know have families so they're not necessarily looking to date those girls mm -hmm. they just see i see a beautiful uh, a proper bone structure i uh, uh and if i, I see some, a type that i want to be in my show uh, what would be the uh, proper way to address that? Uh, without, the way I do it, for example, I, I compliment on particular idea in their address, uh, like your hair and style. Let's say I, if I can talk professionally on on a level about the lipstick or makeup that you wear, th they kind of get, get an idea that I, I'm in the field and uh, they kind of level with me. But if I just say, can I take your picture? Would you like to model? Please say, oh, maybe he just wants to see me naked and that, that's yeah. that's about it like what what would be the like have you encounter let's say you walk the street someone approach you mm -hmm. will you uh, normally they give me their card and then and then they email mm -hmm. me and then i go through their website or their page but and give a card i, I gave hundreds of cards and almost ever ever get returned back i don't maybe it's a quota of my work maybe it's not wow so they, they're not impressed or but, but just giving a card is not uh uh you know they throw it away they you know then call i don't know like, but it's very uh, little result uh, uh oriented for me personally you think the card is, or works i think the cards work i have a lot of cards as a cosmetologist people will always call me I guess. They, they gave you cards and you would look look them up or i would give them cards and they mm. look me up but professionally speaking for the modeling side mm -hmm. of the, the situation um i do everything based off of instagram like networking like that mm -hmm. okay um, so y y I, g I would give you a card that has my instagram you would look my instagram if you see that uh that the photography is well photography orchestrated is and very good then i make the decision mm -hmm. then I, you, you would good, consider or yeah. uh, reach out mm -hmm. i see okay so the instagram is the, the key yeah, uh, for me, that, yeah. for me for, in your yeah. yeah. okay mm -hmm. uh gentlemen ladies uh, who, who are photographers and there are quite a few of them watching my channel so that's uh, I, I guess the uh, best advice uh, you can get today on the uh, recruiting uh, model in the city uh is there a way for you uh, to reach out to you your instagram um um yeah my instagram is uh cindy paduani that's my first and last name c-y-n-d-i-e p-a-d-o-a-n-i pretty much it that's my full name thank you yeah thank you guys